Welcome to Hunting Magic, the show dedicated to hunting and showcasing magical items that are often hiding in plain sight. I'm your host Robbie D and today we're going to be hunting the elusive snake stick. I'm told from a reliable source that they're located in the bush just behind me, but because we're far from civilization, we're going to have to keep our heads on a swivel because help can be days away. Cut. How's that? Does that look all right? Hey, I might get one of those chicken sandwiches up the road. Do you want coffee? I hear they do good chicken sandwiches and coffees here. All right, now I'll be honest. The odds of finding a snake stick out here are pretty slim because they're more than just a little elusive. But I'm sure if we, what, there. It took a little bit of hunting, but we found ourselves our snake stick. So the reason these guys are- Yeah, like, Robbie. What? That's just an ordinary snake, mate. All right, we're real close now. We've found the tree which the snake sticks come from. So using the tree itself, I can show you what they do. We just need a small object. Ugh. Like this little gum nut here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to rub it against the tree and it should vanish into the tree. And that's what snake sticks do. They swallow up whatever they come into contact with, making it disappear without a trace. Let's keep looking. We might get lucky and find one. Well, it took a bit of searching, but we found our snake stick. Now, snake sticks get their name, as I mentioned before, because they possess the power to swallow objects whole. And I'm going to show you what I mean using that rock down there. So we might have to bring the camera down a little bit. So this is what I was talking about. If we take the snake stick and put him in with the rock, what happens is, if you take note of his head in particular, when his head goes up to the rock, wait a bit. Oh, there he goes, he bit. You'll see that he's now got a bulge in his belly because he's eaten the rock. And all we have to do is crack him open. Ah, oh, there we go. And out comes the rock. Now don't worry, this is just his tail. He will grow it back. Off he goes. That's it for today's look at snake sticks. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. I'm Robbie D and I bloody hunt magic.